Setting proper goals for your music career is one of the most important things that you should be doing. And what a lot of artists do is they just go straight into the doing and don't actually plan. They don't actually look at where they're currently at and create goals to get them to where they want to be. So today in this video, I'm going to go through the only two types of goals you need to be successful as a creative, as a musician. What's up guys, AC Evan here from Artist Collective, and if you are here, you're probably a music industry entrepreneur of some sort, so welcome, thank you for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video, throw a comment in. We've got tons of other videos to help you build a profitable music brand, so hang tight. But in today's video, I wanna talk about goals. I wanna talk about setting proper goals for your career. This is something a lot of artists and a lot of our clients fail to do. They just go straight into playlisting and getting a bunch of a big audience and a bunch of numbers without actually knowing where they want to go. So I want to talk about two essential type of goals that you need. Number one, outcome goals. This is the big goals that a lot of you and a lot of artists have no problem coming up with. They would be things like they want to win a Grammy or you want to get a sync placement or you want to start making a hundred thousand dollars a year with your music these are incredible goals however without the proper second type of goal you'll never really get there you can't really just get a grammy right you can't just get a sync placement these are the big wins these are the type of goals that you would call home to mom and said mom i made it i did it it happened right but you need one other element to make this successful for your career. So first of all, make those goals. Look at yourself and say, where do I want to be in a year from now? Do you want to be moved out of your mom's basement? Do you want to get a sync placement? Do you want to land an editorial playlist on Spotify? Figure that out. Really map out what you want your career to look like because it's going to look different for everybody. Then also look maybe five years into the future. Let's go big. Where do you want to be in five years? You want to be making $100,000. You want to have your own studio maybe. Make those plans because they're very important. Write it, on a, write it on a board. Look at it every day. I truly believe in the law of attraction, but I also believe in working towards these goals. That brings me to my second type of goal that is the most crucial and the most forgotten of the two goals. And that is called process goals. These are the small wins. These are the things that you need to, these are the actionable tasks that help get that outcome goal, right? They're not really the fun ones. They're not something you'd call mom or dad and say, hey, I did this. They're things like send out 10 emails, make that phone call to that client that you're trying to close. Those are the process goals that will help get you to that outcome goal. So let's break this down, okay? Let's say you want to get a sync placement in one year. You want your music placed in a TV show or a movie. That's great. You can't just wake up and get that sync placement, right? What do you need to get that sync placement? Well, the process goals underneath those would be to database 50 contacts in that space. So database 50 music libraries or music supervisors or sync agents, right? Maybe another goal would be send 10 emails a day, make five calls a day, make three to seven DMs on Instagram to influential people that will help you get that placement, to help you get that outcome goal. Again, you're not gonna call mom and say, I finished 10 emails, right? But these are the most crucial steps to get there. Artists always just hit those outcome goals and they never address the process goals, those actionable tasks that will get you to your ultimate goal, your ultimate dream. Hopefully that helped. I'd love to hear what some of your outcome goals and process goals are. Hit them in the comments, make sure you subscribe and stick around for some more videos to help you build that music brand. Thanks.